Opened in 1970, Chelmsley Wood Shopping Centre has had its share of ghost stories over the years. The following story has been told to me by a former worker at a shoe shop on the town centre and happened during the 1980s. The woman, whom I will call Sally, had not long been working at the store and was settling into the role well. Her role consisted of serving customers in the main shop and collecting shoes which were stored in the main storeroom, situated directly underneath, the same as most of the shops on the shopping centre. The day had been drawing to a close, and she had been asked to tidy the main storeroom, as during the day shoes tended to be put back in the wrong places and needed to be put back in order. As she was rearranging the stock, she saw her supervisor walk between the shoe racks and disappear back towards the stairs up to the main shop and assumed a customer had come in and was being fitted for shoes. After a little while, Sally had put most of the stock in order and returned to the shop. She approached her supervisor and asked if she had sold the shoes she had been down for or if they needed to be returned to the store. Her supervisor looked puzzled for a moment and told Sally that they had not had a customer and that she had not been down to the storeroom as she could not have left the shop as they were the only staff remaining on site. The supervisor had been cashing up the till. With a smile, she added that Sally had probably seen the ghost. Sally's puzzled look became that of shock as her colleague continued to tell her about a ghostly figure that was regularly seen by staff of the shoe shop, so much so that many of them became too frightened to stay. Others had reported freezing cold spells when it had been warm immediately before and the storeroom lights being turned off, leaving them in pitch-black darkness. On some occasions, a pale figure had been seen gliding between the racking. When the apparition was confronted, it would simply vanish. Sally was made of sterner stuff, and whilst she worked at the shop, encountered the presence on numerous occasions. She said she would talk to the entity when down in the storeroom, which she felt helped her to remain calm. She never heard of the origins of the ghost or the story behind who it may be, but never really felt threatened by it. <laughs>